wild onion, okay, on the trail, out in the woods somewhere, along Cypress Creek. Got some Pennsylvania blackberry here. And some grass and trees and not much. But in here, a little bunch of wild onion. So here's a place where it grows, where it is, as opposed to some others, where to look for it. Right there. Make sure it smells like onion because there's things that people can mistake for onion at the beginning, like rain lily that will kill you. And there's crow's poison, which is not poison. I don't know why it's called that, but um, not nutritious. But you can tell by feeling this stuff how it feels like. Um, what is it? Green onion. And then the more you feel these, the more you get a grasp and knowledge and memory of what they're like. Um, and then if you dig it up, Ta-da! Wild onion. Of course, digging it all up would be stupid because then it wouldn't be here anymore. Totally idiotic. That's what some people do, of course. Um, you want to preserve it for yourself, for others, for the land, for the ecology. So one thing you could do is just take the tops off some of them since they're perennials. Because um, in five or six months, kids like January 1st, 2022, five or six months, the green will not be showing for the wild onion anymore since it's a perennial. It grows, it'll flower, seed, got some other thing it does I forgot what that's called um, it can reproduce sexually or asexually so something that's genetically identical to this itself or something with a mix of other plants other wild onion it can reproduce um, and the green will die back it'll be in the soil and you won't see this at all so it comes up, goes down, ebbs and flows. That's how the wild onion works. But it smells like onion, tastes like onion. You know, that's one thing to do first is to tear some of this off, smell it before you eat it until you get used to it. Um, you can mouth a little bit of the green tot and see that it's onion and not something else. If it's like grass, it's not wild onion. Onion tastes like onion. And sometimes it's like nice and peppery and spicy and sharp, like some I picked recently. Um, sometimes it's milder. And there's different species. But, um, wild onion. Enjoy, respect yourself, respect the ecology of the land, respect the law of nature. Please.